Hi, this is Gary with TheDealFunders.com. We're talking about flipping a house that we did in St. Louis, Missouri with Violetta Kester being the finder. Great job, Violetta, and let's show them what we've done here. I want to show you what we look for when we go into a house and what we see. I don't want you to be looking at the pictures, seeing the living room, dining room, uh, those kind of things. I don't want you looking at the furniture. I want you to look at what needs to be fixed on the house, things in the carpet, things on the walls. Um, the bathrooms, the kitchens, things that need to be updated. When you get to this point, and we had this house under contract, when we have this house under contract, we want to go through and look at all the things we've got to fix. Listen, some of them can be really bad and need a lot of work. And so you've got to see what is it that we can do in this house to make it pop, to take the age away. This is like a 1960s house. Take away the small kitchen. The, the, all the, This is all paneling on the walls. Um, just what can we change to not make it look so dated? Every time you go to look in one of these houses, you're going to come through all kinds of problems and all kinds of struggles. <clears throat> Don't pay attention to those. Pay attention to things that cost you money or that can make you money. What changes can you make? What things can you take out? What things can you change? Matter of fact, these people said you can have anything we leave. It's all yours. Uh, we've got to figure out what it is. We had to bring dumpsters to haul off the stuff they had. And the outside of the house, you can see, is just so dated. It's so overgrown. It's got huge bushes everywhere. When we look at this, we don't look at what's there again. We look at what can we do? What kind of um, flower bed can we do? What stuff can we do? Let me show you just some of the construction phase we did. So the company is working on getting the bushes out, cleaning up the bushes gone. The tree that was cut by the storm is gone. So we'll need to shred it. Take more pictures. looks like the war field looks like a war field the trees are coming down trying to make the backyard bigger but at the same time leaving the privacy so as you can see we brought in equipment and machinery we're tearing out huge trees that make the house look old and then we'll put smaller nicer mulch beds back things that make the house look positive that's what i want to do matter of fact what i do is i take drawings and measurements and i give them to you you give them back to me if you're one of our deal finders and i say take this out leave this cut this give me a measurement give me that tell me exactly what these things are here um, all the measurements of the house take this part of the door out leave this counter could we put a bathroom there i was looking at that uh, what to open what to change that's my job then tiffany comes in takes those measurements and she draws out what we want to do to the house what we're going to change how we're going to do the kitchen how we're going to lay out the outside let's put stone on the corners let's put a new roof on the top and she and i sit down and draw out every little detail of a house to say these are the things we want to change on the house to help the person who found it make this house pop what is it from the front that's going to look at it and people walk up and they first come and go, wow, this is awesome. When they walk in the door, that front door, what is it that's going to make them say, this place is a great place to, to live. We're going to tear out everything that's bad and start putting in everything back we can to make it look new, to make it look different. We're going to change uh, just the whole um, makeup of the house and try to make it not look so 1950s and 60s and try to make it now look into our age, even though it's in an older subdivision, Put in the things that make it pop. You're going to see a lot of deals here, a lot of things that we've changed or done um, that you're going to say, wow, I never thought about doing that to a house. Uh, the steps there, you're going to see them a little bit. Tiffany designed to make the steps bigger and step over or hang over a little bit so that you still have plenty of room for your foot, but we wouldn't have to change a whole lot of the measurements. Um, we tore out floors when we found rotten boards. You're going to see rotten holes in the floor. Don't get discouraged. We, we have to go through and plan for all of these things and all the things that we're seeing. Go, yep, we got to fix this. Yep, we got to fix that and try to make it work out. So in the construction phase, by the way, there's a lot of demo and a lot of things. Don't get scared. Some of you guys that have never flipped a house, but you're brand new to our company and work with us. Don't be afraid. Let's get out there. Let's do this together. And when you see what we do now, the, the finished product, the before and after, you're going to realize, wow, what can we do to a house? The old, take it out, tear it out, and make it look new rip out and open up anything that's, that needs new floors, rebuff the floors, look at the beauty. Um, this used to be the living room underneath with carpet. We found wood floors and so we went in and refinished the floors. Totally changed the kitchen, 
transformed every bathroom to beautiful um, welcoming bathrooms, bathtubs, changed this tub out into a shower, a stand-up shower to make it a little bit nicer, tore the kitchen apart and made it wide open to enclose that, that hole or that space, made it look longer by opening up the walls that are down from there, took out the breakfast nook and made the kitchen larger to give us more space with a small island. The basement, we just ripped out everything, totally transformed the basement from one end to the other and made it beautiful. This is what they left, by the way. Hey, you can have all of that. Um, just going through piece by piece, tore out this big wall for the bar and made the bar where actually you can sit at the bar and see the other people at the bar. Downstairs bathroom, you can catch that wallpaper in the corner. Um, totally transformed that room there. Added a bedroom. That was one of the greatest things we did. We added a bedroom uh, and made it uh, a, whole, a whole lot more usable. Same thing here, flooring underneath the carpet. Refinish it, changed the steps and made the steps larger. See how the steps are a little bit wider and sticking out so you have more foot space. Tore out the window, put in a new window and a heat air conditioner for this room so that it's usable in the winter. Transformed the laundry room so it looks like a whole different place. Tore out this fish tank and the wall and opened up that space. This is what they left. I'm like, oh yeah, leave that pool table and pinball table. No, they left just junk. Uh, just transformed. Now the outside of the house, we put in this stone veneer and it kind of made the house look newer, changed some of the colors, ripped out all the big bushes and uh, power washed all the brick, made it, cleaned it up, made flower beds in the front, tore out the trees. There's like this old tree, there's uh, several other trees across there. You can't even see the garage on this side. Look, the garage is missing. Boom, ripped them out, cleaned them up. And there's what we had left after we tore it apart. The backyard ripped out big trees, put in small trees and shrubs, cleaned everything up. Um, put in uh, uh, where you see these vines, rip that off, put in the window and the air conditioner there and took the hot tub away. Uh, that's the back door to the laundry room there. Cleaned up the backyard, made it way further back, seated the thing. It's what you want to do to a house. It wants you, you want to make that transformation that's just a wow factor that, oh my goodness, it goes from yuck to unbelievable. That's what we want to do. And that's what sells houses, by the way. Come on down to thedealfunders.com thedealfundersblog.com and join us. We'd love to have you on our team.